Hey, hey, it's Lamar Scholl coming at you from DirectionToSuccess.com. Try to change it up a little bit today. Um, listen, I don't know if you're like me, but you know, you have, when you set a goal, you're all enthusiastic when you first start, and then that enthusiasm starts decaying over time, which is probably a day or two, right? It doesn't take long. Well, uh, but two months ago, I found a website called Stick S T I C K K dot com that helps you stick to your goal. You actually can get a referee, you know, which is somebody that will monitor all your progress, and you have to make posts. So this is good for, you know, like if you want to create videos and you just have a hard time getting started. That's what I did. Um, so I actually did a video, like I said, two months ago when I first started my goal. This video is on the day that I finished my goal and proud of it. I should have made this my last post up into stick my report, but I didn't. Anyhow, it helped me a lot. If you want to find out more, stick around. Today, I want to talk about one of the ways that you can stick to goals. When you're setting a goal, you know, you're all excited when you first start. You know, when I say you, it's everybody. It's me, it's you, right? Um, and that momentum seems to die maybe after a day or two, right? And then you start making excuses. Well, about two months ago, well, it's exactly two months ago, I showed you this website called stick, S-T-I-C-K-K dot -K com. This helped me to stick to one of my goals. And my goal was to create four videos each week. So that was my goal. And when you use this website, what you do is I went in and donated to a charity, not a charity that I like because if I failed then the money would go to them which is still a good thing I did not do that I took an anti charity a charity that well just trying to be kind just didn't like so much right so that was my momentum to keep me going because one I didn't want to pay money to the charity that I put up two I don't I didn't want to fail at this goal anyways because I didn't want to have to tell my coach I'd had to give my money up. The money would have been probably the least of it. Telling my coach that I didn't make my goal was the other thing. Um, the third thing is we were setting out to do one month goals. And when I say we, it's not me, myself, and I, it's the group that we were in with our coach. He said, you know, make a one month goal and then it has to be a daily type of thing, right? Or a weekly thing. It isn't like, oh, I'm going to write this email I have to do and, oh, my goal is done, right? It has to be over a period of time. So what I decided to do, instead of making it a month, <clears throat> excuse me, I wanted to make it two months. And you can set all this up in um, this website called Stick. But the reason why I wanted to make it two months for me is so that I could grow. Like if I did four, you know, one month and I did four, vi uh, say seven videos a month, I would have just been make, you know, probably putting them out, not worrying about the quality, right? Just getting something out there because it's just a task I have to do. And I didn't want to do that when it came to my videos. I wanted to learn. I wanted to make the videos worthwhile that somebody will get value out of them when they watch them, right? So I didn't make a video every day. I made a video every four days. And instead of just a month, I extended it to two months. So today, I finally uploaded my last, well, my post on to stick. I am not going to stop doing the videos because now, hopefully, I formed a great habit out of this. If you want to know more information on stick, I have another video I did when I first started this challenge, and I'll leave the link below for that. So I'm not going to go through and tell you all what sticks up. I'm just telling you, like, I feel good that I made my goal. I had till eight tonight, 
I actually exceeded because like my last week, I decided to kind of put the metal, pedal to the metal, that is it. And instead of just doing four videos this week, I did seven. I did a video every day. I'll have to admit, I had them in a queue, kind of built up a little bit ahead of time on my computer. So I was just able to upload the final ones. But I still accomplished my goal. So the what am I trying to say out of all this? You stick, go in, you can get, you know, a referee and you should, you know, donate some money, put some money up, you know, like just put your money where your mouth is because you, you got to give yourself a reason or reasons for not failing, right? And the goal is going to be worthwhile. You have to do it anyways. I was, I'm definitely still need a lot more practice on my videos, obviously, but I'm trying and I'm going to stick to it and I'm going to get better. So I'm going to wait for a few days and come up with another goal that I want to do. So like I said, the best way stick works is if you have to do things over time. You know, what are other good examples? Maybe you have to write an email every day. Well, put that, you know, put that goal in stick. Find your charity you don't want to donate money to. I'm sorry to word it like that, but it's going to help. It helps. Find somebody to referee. Just, you know, make sure somebody's there. So with all that blab being said, let me just take you over to stick real quick. So now that we're in here, so you can see here is my goal. Create four videos a week for YouTube. I probably should have said for my YouTube channel. So that's what it was really for. So if I click over here on the arrow, when I put my goal in, it was like two months ago. So here's the um, time when the goal you know is going to end. So it's today, October 25th at 8. So this is all the posts I was have been doing so you just I just write a quick one sentence taken for me it was easy since I was doing a video I took an image of my screen after I uploaded my video to YouTube so why was this important Be I don't know if I can click on this we'll see yeah so um, yeah it doesn't show in this one here I probably messed that one up here let me try to go back again or I didn't see it let me uh, Let's see here. Uh, go back. Uh, whoops, sorry, went too far. Let me uh, go back into. Let's see, home. Sorry about that. I was trying to show you that there's a date on the image of when I uploaded my video. So let's try this again. So we'll go back in. I'm just gonna go down. Let's go. Um, let's. So you can see I've got like good eight, nine pages of post here, right? So let's go like, so here's page nine. So here was my first one I did on August 20. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry, August 31st. So there you go. So we're going to upload this. And this was my very first video. Yeah, you can't quite see it. But when you post upload a video on YouTube, it tells you the date right here when it was published. So that's all I did and just wrote a one liner, you know, the date of the post for me and created and the video name. And that was it. And just to keep a record of that. So that is how I use this website called Stick. And the website, by the way, is free. Uh, it's not free for the money that you put up, obviously, but it's a free website nonetheless. So like I said, I'm pumped. I'm going to get another goal, you know, that I have to do, and I'm going to put it in stick because it's something that helps me quite a bit. So I hope you got value out of this video. And for this video to make more sense, go back and watch the first one. And like I said, I'll include a link below and have a great day. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions at all, leave a comment in this video i love answering comments and i reply back to each and every one of them and also if you like the video
go ahead and smash that like button. 